Hello everyone and welcome back to Coral Island. My name is Melanie V. It is now Sunday, the seventh day of spring in year number two. Okay, we've got some mail today from Noah. Christian, Christian Sips needs a couple of fresh flowers. Would your farm be able to supply them? If so, please have them delivered as soon as possible. P.S. Sam doesn't have a good selection. Gah! Okay, and another letter. Melanie P, meet me at the beach west of the diving spot tomorrow evening. See you at 6 p.m. Um, who is this from? Uh, this is awkward. So we gotta bring some flowers to Noah, but we have a special date that we have to go on, I guess? <laughs> I don't know if it's a date or not, but that, that was definitely interesting. Let's go ahead and grab some shard. Now, did we have shard last spring? I don't think I remember it. But before we actually harvest our crops, we should let our animals out. Let them catch some fresh air. Okay, come out everyone. Now, I can't remember. Did I put butter into the barn and coop yesterday? I certainly hope so. Let's go check on that right now. Okay, it looks like I did because we're not completely out. Let's get six pieces of hay and we'll load up the trot. And we have one little goat that's inside. Come on outside, little buddy. Get some fresh air. Everyone else is out and about. Here he comes. So we got two cows, two goats, and two sheeps all to take care of today. But everybody is on the same cycle at least. So we like that. Okay, let's get our milk pail and our shares. Okay, we'll start with our sheep. We've got some large wool. And some more large wool. And from our goats, what are we going to get? Regular goat's milk. What about you? Uh, just regular goat's milk. I really want some nice large milk. Okay, well, they are petted for today, so hopefully next time around, they'll give us some good stuff instead. Okay, let's close the gate back. We're gonna chuck some milk in here. Um... I want to see what else I can put into these mason jars. So we're making some butter with the milk. What else? Can we put cheese into it? No. <laughs> that would be interesting if we could. But we cannot. Okay. Well, in that case, let's go ahead and sell the cheese. I'm going to keep the wool. Now we got this large salted duck egg. I wonder what we can do with that. Um, I don't know if it's something we can cook with or not. Maybe we should just hang on to it then. Okay, we'll close the skate back so our animals don't go wandering around. Put those away. And we'll head over to the coop. Hello, little birdies. I think we need to get another quail so we can even things up. Or, actually we have three chickens. We got one too many chicken, not enough quails or ducks. Can we afford to buy those though? Got 25,000 coins right now. So I guess we could. Or should we be saving our money for something else? Okay, we got some hay to fill up the trough. There we go. So I'm gonna put these eggs in into the mason jars. In you go. One there, one there. And 
We'll set aside our milk here. We'll make some more cheese later. And let's get back to harvesting. We are going to need some more seeds today, too. Now, Sam is going to be open at noon, so... Maybe we'll head over to Sam's in a little bit. Let's finish grabbing some stuff. Yeah, we got some radish ready, too. Love to see it. Now... I'm wondering if we have enough essence or... A uh, silver cup, I think, is what we needed to make some more sprinklers. So maybe we should see if we can make some of those today. Actually, I haven't been going into the right part of the ocean to get silver kelp. So we probably cannot. Sprinkler. That's too big. We don't need that big of a sprinkler. This is the ones we need. We need prawn kelp now. Okay, so we need to go into the earliest part of the ocean to find a bronze kelp. Um, maybe we'll get around to that today. Look at this, we got some flowers. So maybe we can go help Noah out today. Give him what he's requested. And look at all of our beautiful trees. So we got... Seedlings and saplings, so these ones are the ones that require the four plots, and these ones just require the single spot. Need space around them, though. But the thing about these is they take 28 days to grow, so that, that's going to be a while before they're ready. So right now we got six sprinklers open, so we are definitely going to get those filled. What are we going to do with our radishes? Um, none of our kegs are empty yet. And all of our mason jars are still on the go. Can we actually make another keg or two? Yeah, we do have what we need. Let's make a couple more. Two new kegs for us. Okay, keg number one can go... Right there. We'll put the other one here. Could we fit it in? It's kind of in an awkward place, but <laughs> we'll make it work. We can't put any flowers into the keg. Good to know. But we can put ch chard in there and make some chard juice. That sounds disgusting too. All of the juices you can make with the kegs, if it's not like wine, it sounds gross. I don't know. Vegetable juice is not appealing to me at all. <laughs> okay, what are we putting in the fridge? So, do we have any chard in here from before? Uh, we've gotten radishes in before. Let's top that up a bit. And we'll have to put some chard into our storage chest right here. I think we'll go with this silver bundle since we have mostly that one. There we go. And I think we'll still, uh, save the rest to process into some juice. We'll save the radishes too. Now for the flowers. What are we going to do with the flowers? Now, what the flowers can we actually make? Um, I need this up here. Okay. Bouquets. So the bouquets take any flowers. So even the ones we harvested, not just the wild flowers. Let's make a couple of those. Maybe we can get some flowers today. And before we go, let's put some of our kelp essence away. In you go. We'll put the stone away too. We got some glass we can leave there. Let's close up the gate. The quail is trying to escape here. Okay, so the loom has got some large cloth on there. Got some batteries ready. Let's grab those. Take some glass too. 
and we'll hop over the fence. No need to open the gate when we can just hop. We're gonna be selling some some of this juice. Uh, let's put our trash away. What else can we put away here? The battery packs? Sure. Okay, and we'll head into town. Oh my gosh, how did it get to 3 o'clock? Are we going to make it to Sam's in time? I don't know. I don't know. I think Sam closes early on Sundays. Oh, there's Scott. Okay, he's still open. We'll go back and give Scott a bouquet in a second. But for now, we need to get to Sam. Hey, Sam. What are we buying from Sam, though? Um... Should we get some more carrots? Or should we get some peas? I don't know. Carrot sounds good. That's not what we harvested today, though. Maybe we should just get what we harvested and plant some more. So, today we got some chard. Let's grab some of those. Got some radishes. We'll grab some more of those, too. And, oh, I really should get more strawberries, but we already planted a bunch of strawberries. Just have to wait for them to grow. Um, cauliflower, what do we think? Maybe we should get some of these. I'm kind of like wanting to get more strawberries. Oh boy. Or maybe we can get some more of these uh, ch uh, seedlings. Now, did we get all of these planted? Maybe we should get a banana. Let's get one banana. Now the plum rambutan. I'll get a plum. I'll get a rambutan. Actually, I feel like I've already bought these before. I don't want to waste my money, you know? Okay, we're not getting anything else. We're saving our money. Let's see what's on the quest board. And there's an urgent request from Deepa for potatoes. We can accept it. We're probably not going to actually do it because I never managed to get them done. That's for you, Scott. The system at the museum was down the other day. Thankfully, Lily was able to stop by and help out. Okay, good for you and Lily. That's for you. Oh, this is so nice of you. I promise I'll put it to good use. I need to figure out what, like, Scott really likes. I could have tried to fix it, I guess. But I didn't know how. Haha. <laughs> okay, <laughs> he's talking about the problem Lily fixed for him. That's fine. It's done. It's fixed. It's working. Oh, it's Antonio's birthday today. Um, should we, like, give Antonio a gout? I don't even know where Antonio is. Antonio. Oh, right up here. Yeah, let's go gift him something. Why not? We are good people. And we got a bouquet, and I think everybody likes bouquets. Maybe. You know, I really should put some more effort into befriending people. Oh, look at this. We got a widow spider in our trap. We'll take that. Got a bunch of flowers. Wild flowers to collect. Where did Antonio go to? Oh, I'm in the wrong direction. I am slightly lost. Navigation is not my forte. Okay, he's down this way. There he is. Frank C has been a boon for fashion. My boutique is now overflowing with the latest clothing trend. Do drop by and revamp your wardrobe. Okay. Uh-huh. Do you want this gift? Ah, I'll put the gift. Thank you. You're very kind. I don't know if you really liked it or not. Okay, uh, let's check out our friendship now. Oh, we have three hearts, so I guess he liked it. We should really try to give people birthday gifts. Um, let's go check out the calendar. And see if we can figure out whose birthday is coming up next. And see if we can't, like, be sure to gift everyone on their birthdays, at least on their birthdays. 
So, oh, it's also Paul's birthday. Um, we are gonna go find Paul next. Okay, Paul, where are you hanging out today? There he is, on the beach. So, we're gonna craft up some more flowers. I love that we can just craft from our global chest here. That is fantastic. We'll take one of you. And let's head down to the beach. We'll check out the coffee shop. Nothing we can afford. Um, are we in the correct area to find Paul? Not quite. Uh, can we go up this way? No, we cannot. Looks like Sam is done for today. Here's Paul. Cauliflower season, isn't it? Yeah, I should know. I used to be obsessed with growing it. My mom's favorite vegetable. But is it your favorite vegetable? This is special. Thank you for the birthday gift. Okay, let's see. Now, Paul. Are we doing good with Paul? Um... Okay, yeah, we're three hearts with Paul now, too. Awesome. Well, it's already 5.30, and we haven't gotten down to the ocean as yet. I think we need to head over there right away. We are gonna have to... I want to plant these saplings, though. And these other vegetables. Okay, we're not gonna have very much time in the ocean today. That's okay. We can always go another day. And I don't think we actually purchased enough seeds. So we're gonna have two empty sprinklers, I guess. Maybe we have some wild seeds we can plant. And we also didn't water these, these plants up here, do we? Oh my goodness, things are not looking good for us getting into the ocean today. We squandered our time. Okay, do we have any seeds? Any seeds at all would be nice. Oh, we also have this apple, but that is for fall. We're not going to worry about that then. Um, do we have any seeds here? Oh, we got three. <laughs> We're going to have to make do with that. And let's get this in here. Let's go ahead and plant those three wild seeds. And we're going to plant some more saplings. Um... No, these aren't saplings. These are the seedlings. Get it straight. And we got one more to go. This is going to be a lot of watering. Um, actually, let's try putting some... Some fertilizer on it. There we go. Done. Now we just need to water all of these. So we don't need to water the... the saplings at all. Seedlings definitely needs water. Yeah, today is not gonna be a day for the ocean. So I think instead... Oops. We are going to go do some foraging for the rest of our day. Or maybe we should just clean up on the farm. The farm needs a lot of work still, I think. Okay, just one spot there missing. So, we can chop down a few trees. I really should plant my trees in a different spot, I think. Okay, so let's grab our axe. 
I'll take my pickaxe too, just in case we encounter any stone or rocks. Like right here. Get rid of it. We really don't need any wood. But we definitely need to clear up the farm. It's been over a year since we've been here. And yeah, we're not fully really utilizing our farm to the max right now. So there must be something we can do with wood. What can we make with all this wood that we are accumulating? Get rid of this stone. Let's constantly miss this little tree here. <laughs> All this space, we can use it for like a production area. And we did get that message from Ling yesterday about us. Special chest we can use to automate. So maybe we should actually head over to Ling's tomorrow to do... To check that out and see what we can make. Maybe it's something that requires a lot of wood. But it's almost midnight now. We don't have that much energy left. We'll expend as much as we can. Okay, let's get this little tree gone. And we'll see what else we can make with our wood. We can make a mushroom log. Um, it's an artisan equipment. What do you do with that? Uh, that's interesting. Um, we really don't have very much space out here. I really need to set up my farm a little bit better. It produces mushroom over time. Oh, well, that's kind of cool. Maybe we can leave that in this area instead. Now to make that, we just need wood and compost. And that's something we have tons of. Wood and compost both. Which reminds me, since we have lots of trash as well, let's make even more compost. Look how much trash we've got. We got two full stacks and then some. Should we be making another composter, I wonder? Okay, well, we're gonna make some more compost and scraps. How much does it cost to make the composter? Compost bin? It takes trash, wood, and sap. Um, sure. We're making another one. We'll set that right there. And we'll fill it with some trash. There we go. It is so late. Let's grab some stuff and get it sold. And, and we'll probably need to put some more stuff in to brew overnight. Let's take some of this radishes out of here. Now... We'll pull these machines up. If we can get to them, that is. Oh my goodness. Okay, it's super late. We gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. No! Well, that's unfortunate. But look at this. Our friendship with Antonia and Paul has increased. So it looks like it's plus two hearts for Antonia and just one for Paul. Okay, so we must have had some hearts with them from before. And we did not get to sell very much. We didn't make it over to our cell bin in time. 
but we did make 949 coral coins for today not bad and i think that's going to be it for today's episode thank you very much for watching 